As the first black woman to receive a Juno Award, Liberty Silver is widely known for paving the way for future generations of black female artists in the Canadian music industry. In 1985, she won two Juno Awards, one for Best R&B Soul Recording of the Year for Lost Somewhere Inside Your Love, the other for Best Reggae Calypso Recording for Heaven Must Have Sent You with Otis Gale. In total, she's been nominated for five Junos. The industry has always been a bit baffled about exactly where to slot her. Silver's first album was Jazz. She's been Jazz Report Magazine's Female Singer of the Year and headlined the Smooth Jazz Awards at Mississauga's Living Arts Centre with George Benson. She's also had a number one Canadian country hit. When only 12 years old, Silver performed in a reggae band as an opening act in New York City for Bob Marley at Madison Square Garden. And in 2000, she hosted a TV series known as Center Stage Chronicles. As a member of the David Foster-produced Canadian supergroup Northern Lights, she appeared on the platinum-selling 1985 African charity ensemble single Tears Are Not Enough, singing a duet with Mike Reno of Loverboy. Other artists on that track included Brian Adams, Anne Murray, and Joni Mitchell. Silver competed as a vocalist on Star Search, winning the competition several weeks in a row. And in 2016, she sang Amazing Grace at the funeral of former Toronto Mayor Rob Ford. Other prominent figures Silver has performed for include former U.S. President Barack Obama, Celine Dion, Desmond Tutu, and former President of the Soviet Union, Mikhail Gorbachev. If they can't class her, at least they know she has class. She has shared stages with Harry Belafonte, Aretha Franklin, B.B. King, the SOS band, Manhattan Transfer, Maya Angelou, Natalie Cole, Mary Wells, and Stevie Wonder. Silver lives in Mississauga, and with her own home studio, she controls her own career and keeps her musical integrity intact.